continuing our team coverage. We bring in our Jemai Webster, spend most of the day in Laie gathering community reaction. Jemai. That's right, Robert. Pretty much a typical day in this small, tight-knit North Shore community. But once we arrived, most people had one thing on their minds. That's this hoax surrounding Manti Teo. There's been a lot of stories about him, but I know that is not true. I know Manti is my, is my nephew. Talked to dozens of Laie residents, including Auntie Lohotai Ao, but a lot of people still hadn't heard a thing. From my own personal opinion, I don't really care. Several others we talked to weren't willing to go on camera, but those that were were supportive of Manti Teo, the athlete, and the individual. Well, I just think it's an unfortunate thing. I think it's an unfortunate event for the family. Uh, you know, Manti means a lot to this uh, community. We're proud of him. We love him, and uh, we appreciate that. Uh, you know, all that he's meant to our the, the youth of uh, Laie and the youth of the North Shore. The community we will always support him, no matter what. Um, especially here in Hawaii, and there's a lot of supporters for him. So um, the fact of to, f to fix it, just, just tell the truth. Uh, feel for the family and for the school, and I heard they're looking into it. So, uh, you know, I hope they find out what's really going on here. Love you, Mantai. Now, still a lot of questions to be answered. Notre Dame Athletics Director Jack Swarbick today said he expects Mantai to tell his side of the story Maybe as soon as tomorrow. We stopped by the tail house this afternoon. No comment from his family. Kenny.